So the boys recently ended and we were all caught off guard, but now all we can think of is what's next? I'm Lavita Josue and this is Comrom, where we do nerdy reviews with the occasional booze. Amazon thrilled us yet again with season two of The Boys. They broke down this season into a weekly affair and the last two episodes went down harder than Black Noir eating an almond joy. It goes without saying, if we're talking season three theories today, there will be huge spoilers for season two. So back out if you haven't seen it yet. You still here? Okay, cool. As of the end of the season, Stormfront is dead. A-Train is back in the seven and Maeve and Starlight have dirt on Homelander that keeps him off their back, for now at least. These things bring up major curiosities for next season. The fact that A-Train made it back into the seven, but the deep didn't, it makes us wonder. How will the deep react in the long run? We saw him turn from sexual predator to outcast to sob story and then to a success story, but what's next? Will he continue to try to get back in the seven or will he try to get back at the seven? On to Huey. Our wide-eyed doorway into this series has decided to blaze his own trail this time around and leave the boys in order to pursue what he thinks are safe and noble means. Maeve brought us the ending to season two that we all needed by blackmailing Homelander into backing the f off and for now that's working. Will this mean that she's able to happily continue her relationship with Elena or someone else without needing to worry about Homelander wrecking things for her? I guess we'll see. Homelander was last seen on the literal and metaphorical ledge preparing to present the world with something unexpected. We all know that he doesn't deal with being told what to do so this arrangement with the ladies will definitely make him a powder keg for this season's plot. Which makes us wonder if Homelander ever decides to go off the rails who can really stop him at this point? One of the only only things that we know about season three is that Jensen Ackles is joining the cast as Soldier Boy. Soldier Boy is basically a Captain America spoof, but there is one detail that makes us think that there may be more to him than expected. In the comics, he occasionally recites the states, and we heard from Ryan that he does the same thing. Why is this a trade that they share? I mean, damn, she really kept that boy in the mouth house. Is Soldier Boy also connected to Homelander in some way? Is he strong enough to take out Homelander? Where are they going with Ryan and what are their plans for him? With Mallory and the boys getting an official team started, it puts them closer to where they started in the comics and gives them a legit new reason to be at war with the soups. That coupled with Huey's inevitable discovery of Newman's mind-blowing abilities will get the action going for the next season. What are some of your favorite scenes from the most recent season? Season two. Do we think that Black Noir is gonna be all right? Or maybe he'll stick to mounds from now on. How crazy will that spinoff be? It's basically the X-Men school, but set in the gritty, ridiculous world of the boys. That's gonna be wild. So if you like this season three theory video, go ahead and hit the like button. Make sure that you subscribe and you hit the bell so you're notified the next time that we post a video. I'm Levita Josue, and this is Comrom, where we do nerdy reviews with the occasional booze. I like